How would you like to travel from LA to New York in just 45 minutes? Stay tuned to find out how. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another 10 Reasons Why Show Tech with me, Scott Tommaso. It is the show that highlights the day's hottest tech for you, the layman. And I cannot express enough how good it is to be back after such a long hiatus, but I do have some great piece of tech news for you that you're going to love, especially if you live in L.A. or San Francisco or somewhere in between. Now, many of you have already probably heard about an ultra-fast transport system that will shoot people through tubes a lot like Futurama, if you know what I'm talking about, from one city to the next in zippity doo -dah time. And the man behind this idea is CEO of SpaceX and Tesla, Elon Musk. So let's talk about this transport system. Simply put, it is basically a giant vacuum tube. Think about those old school vacuum tubes you used to find at bank tellers. You'd put your money in the little tube and it would shoot off to the bank teller. Or a lot like those mail systems that they had in the old business buildings. You put the mail in a container, put it in the vacuum tube, shoots up. It's a lot like that, but of course this one shoots people instead of mail or money. But even cooler than the concept is actually the engineering behind it. Not only will this run completely on solar power, but people will travel on this thing with amazing comfort because they'll be floating on air much like an air hockey table and at a comfortably low 1G of force at top speed. And speaking of speed, this sucker is fast. How fast? Well, it's nearly four times faster than Eurostar, the high-speed railway that connects London to Paris and Brussels. It's also about three times faster than Japan's bullet train and nearly 200 miles per hour faster than a Boeing 737. Translation, you'll be able to travel from LA to New York in just 45 minutes, New York to China in just two hours, and be able to take a round the world trip in just six hours. So this, my friends, is a very real concept and some of the brightest minds in the world are actually working on it right now. In fact, here's where you might find future Hyperloop stations. Now, I don't know about you, but I would vote for this thing in a heartbeat. Not only because it's kick-ass, but also because it'll cost less than one-tenth that of a high-speed rail transport system and about one-fourth the price of a new highway. And let's be honest, who really wants another highway, especially if you live in LA or San Francisco? <laughs> Well, that's my show for today. Let me know what you guys think about this new Hyperloop. Would you vote for it? Would you want one? Would you want it coming through your city? I'm guessing probably a lot of you would say yes, but I'm still interested to hear what you think about it, especially if you disagree with it. So thanks for watching. Now go tech yourself before you wreck yourself. And I have to say, it's great to be back. Hello everyone and thanks again for watching the video. Go ahead and hit subscribe below. If you're one of those people that loves to, to listen on the go, be sure to subscribe to our podcast on iTunes. Just click the link below. In the meantime, check out some of our sample videos. Just click on them and it'll take you right there. And we thank you again for checking us out. Click it. Go on, click it.